let's talk about the electronic transitions in the hydrogen atom. Specifically, when hydrogen is in n equal 4, an excited state, and the electron drops down to n equal 2, a not so excited state, a photon of light will be emitted, corresponding to the energy difference between n equal 4 and n equal 2. We can calculate the energy difference and calculate the wavelength of the photon that's emitted. So the energy levels go as minus z squared over n squared times the Rydberg constant. If we're going to change energy levels, then the change in energy is z squared r infinity, 1 over the uh, final transition minus the, the first uh, transition value, so 2 and 4 in this case. We can put in all those numbers. Here's z. We're talking about hydrogen atom. So the charge on the nucleus, z, is 1. The two states from the n equal 2 to n equal 4 state, I'm doing a transition where it's emission. I'm starting out in 4 and going to the n equal 2 state. I can find that that gives me 3 sixteenths times the value of the Rydberg constant. And the value of the Rydberg constant, I'm using in hertz here because that's the most straightforward way to get back to wavelength. I could use energy here in joules, but it's a little easier to get from wavelength to frequency back and forth. So this value, 6.16 times 10 to the 14th hertz, is the energy difference in hertz. The wavelength is given by the speed of light over the frequency. I now have the frequency. So the speed of light, 3 times 10 to the 8th, over our frequency gives me a wavelength of 446 nanometers. So a photon of blue light will be emitted by hydrogen atoms when they undergo a transition from an n equal 4 to n equal 2 state.